Maybe I get some more of them when it comes closer. I never got back up here to find him. He's only five minutes ahead of him. But he's got somewhere to lay down. There's a big old rabbit, so he ain't too far ahead of him. Uh, you see, this is yeah, wrapped chicken wire. It's not pretty tight, it's pretty loose on this side. But I think that's what he has all around the place. Um, Pen's been here for. I was probably a kid. I know I was a kid. My dad raised some beagles for him one time. He, well, he had a little and he sold him to him. Uh, my dad knew him. My dad's known him for a long time now. They used to work together and stuff, but uh, years ago. He had all kinds of stuff back here. Uh, old dog boxes. Old dog boxes here. Old pins. George over trying to scratch it something up. There he is. It's like Chase. Chase and George. Good job, boys. They, they found him. I haven't been back here before in this park. Usually try to stay out of his woods. He's pretty. I seen that rabbit. Chase found him. That was good. There's too much glass back here to really be running, dogs. Most of the dog's feet get cut back here. Okay, let's chase the judge. Here comes Beast. Let's see if I find my way through these woods. It's a long way back the other way. So why not? Um, I thought the rabbit head came from farther down than that. I could probably stay here. Eat swamp. And watch the rabbit fight all day. That's how often they come through here. Um, usually they just don't go as far up as that one did. They usually stop about in here or they circle back. Alright, I'll just pass forward. I'm making it across. I got all my hunting boots. So I don't matter. Just don't want my feet wet, y'all. Dog, I got no idea what happened. They just went radio silent. You probably ain't gonna be able to see that rabbit on video. I barely caught the glimpse of him. What I saw was his back when he was going up around the hill. Okay. He went a long way off from where I'm at. He kept back and went to the other side. Pen. But sounds like it might just bring him back. Yeah. This is the jump over here, so let's make this way around. There's an opening up here. If I get to it, I can watch that rabbit again. Maybe I guess a good video of him today. This is why I come to the running pen. Good fun. Dogs ain't gotta worry about getting away from me either. And it's good training for one. I 
get the experience here, they get the experience four or five different terrain. Oh yeah, they went all the way to the other side. He's either done it across it probably. He zigzagged on him. Good job, four dogs packing together. I like that. My dogs don't always pack, so when I do get in a pack, I'm doing pretty darn good. Dogs. A lot of people like all their dogs with the same kind of mouth. I don't care too much for that. I like to be able to tell my dogs distinctly from others. Especially like when I'm doing trials and stuff, I want to know where my dogs is at. Swimming's killing them on this side. Scratch harder. I don't think today was perfect for conditions, but I, wonder, I, wonder, I needed to get them out. Uh, I'm probably gonna have them over here at least once, twice more next few weeks. You know, next week, probably bring them over summer nights. And once it starts getting real hot, I'll start coming at night. Chase has got pretty big. He ended up, I think, in the 14 inch class right now. 14 and a half, maybe, maybe 15. Y'all don't think he's scratching 15 yet. Yeah, he's done it. Came on through here. I think he probably came a moment. Okay, Chase is getting him. Um, judges right here. I see him. He's got a lot of the markings. I like has. has. He's a long dog. Pretty tall, too. He's about the same height as Beast almost. Beast in the 16, 17 inch class. Pretty big dogs. Where's he at, boy? Come on, take him back to the jump. There you go. Get him up, Leah. He threw a bunch of corn out here this year. See, it's growing up green right here. <laughs> he's making his own little food plots. Um, the running pen we've been going to, I'm doing my hunts at. I haven't been getting much video. It's over a 50 acre pen. And the dogs, the only time you see them, it's in packs of 30 or 40 dogs at one time. And To me, it's fun, but I just don't care for that much speed. I personally don't. I had never my dogs work the trail. Didn't work. Work their speed on the rabbit. And a bunch of people agree with me there. Yeah, I think this rabbit went back toward the jump site.
Joey's barking right now. Deep bottom out. He stayed consistent, they went up and out there, he stayed. He's fighting hard for him. Uh, I know he's fighting for the confidence still when it comes to running. I mean, all of them trust him in the pen. Uh, that's one kind of a reason I've held him, had him held up. Another reason, the main reason he's been held up is um, the day, I, the day after I got him, he got out that night. Then he got out two more times afterwards. Um, first time he got out, he came right to me. Okay, he's solo in this one. No, he came right to me. Afterwards, um, he got out again, and when I went to try and leash him, he was following me, so I didn't leash him. And I had Chase on the leash, and I fell. And when I fell, I kind of fell towards him, and it scared the crap out of him, and Almost for an hour and a half, I chased him, trying to get him, and he just had nothing to do with me. So finally, my dad came outside, and he finally encouraged him back into the pen. <laughs> but um, I'm held him held up these two and a half weeks, just uh, well three weeks, just to gain his confidence back. Um, I scared the crap out of him. It was my fault. I shouldn't have chased him like I was. Um, accidents, accident, and falling. Uh, but it's all right. Um, he's calmed down now. He'll come right to me. I took got him. We had to go in and actually force him onto the leash. So that's one of the ways we got him and how he gained our confidence back. We got him out, just walked around the land with Leah. Played with him with our hands for a little bit, twice. And that's how far he's came since. He's letting me bring him out and come to me. And I whistle. Um, he's not as hard headed so far as Mother Dog. <laughs> but he hangs around him long enough, he'll be hard headed like him. Yeah, my boy right there placed eighth place. Still got a little bit of paint on him. He's not a judge is in a normal black and tan. Well he's kinda of normal. He's just got white tips and a white underbelly. A little white on his neck. Bloody tail, I like to see it. Come here boy. Judge. Um I named him Native Pride's Judge. Um, that's why I named my kennels as Native Pride. Um, I didn't name my dad when the name him was Took, so. He'll go right to the barking. That's what I like. Got like in one spot. Where 
fucking barking right there as if there's a hole there. There's a trail. No hole. They were just going the wrong way. I'm trying to decipher. Chase H, you had it right. Good job. Well, he didn't even make it all the way back to the jump spot. I think they kind of cut him off. That's my boy. He's grown up to be daddy's boy. Done, I feel like I've done really good with him. Um, days like this, it's helping him to learn to take control of the pack. It's not always Beast's job to take control. So it's good to teach my other dogs how to do it. Especially Chase. Chase, like I said, he's young. He's still learning. I got to get him out on his solos. I uh, went this trapping this week for Sadie. Sadie's doing good. Um, Sadie's at home today. She's not yet equipped or for this because of my work schedule. She's not up to par like she should be, and that's my fault. For but it's, then again, it's not my fault. A man's got to do what a man's got to do to work. Um, she's good sight chasing. Good. Real good. Run the rabbit down until it falls out. Um, she's, I've turned a rabbit loose in the yard once and let her chase it. Uh, she's doing real good with that. Um, she chased him until she lost sight of him. She used her nose. He got on the ditch bank and laid down. She used her nose, found him, and went to him. She didn't bark, but Chase used to not either. That took time to get him to bark. Um, I think it was maybe the second or third time I ch had Chase out on the rabbit. He started barking. I didn't get to video it that day, but I think it'll be all right. Eventually, she'll be out here running with the big dogs. Right now, I think she's eight and a half months old, eight months old. Maybe not. The guy we bought her from said she was 10 weeks when we bought her. She's a big dog, but she's not as big as... Uh, eight month old should look to me. Usually, eight month old near some dogs look about grown. She's still a lot of puppy features. Um, a lot of puppy features. But that's okay. She's growing at her own pace. She's learning at her own pace. So. Dogs all over the place trying to scratch this rabbit. Days are looking for him. Days are looking for him. <laughs> they ain't done the best running, but it's still a success. I got him out and got him packing like he's supposed to be back doing. Um, last time I had him out, before season went out, I was taking video. But it sucked. Let's just say it. I, I didn't get no kills that day. His running just sucked. Um, I took him out a few times before, and I've had three chases going one shot. They'd be all over the place, basically. So I didn't really know how to deal with it. Uh, I'm gonna go pop a squat up here. I'll get back with you guys in a few.